hi guys and welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you're doing well and good and if you're new here hi welcome to my channel thank you so much for clicking on this video and for today's video it is my long awaited ultimate gift guide for him so it is the men's turn on my channel today and um, it is to give you guys some ideas some suggestions um some christmas inspo what to get get the men in your life so that could be your boyfriend your brother your husband your granddad your dad your your dad and yeah so that video is that is what today's video is about i am also going to be uploading a christmas children's gift guide over the next couple of lighting and um, it is now the 2nd of december so it is vlogmas so this is my first ever christmas vlogmas on my channel because this is the first christmas i've ever had a youtube channel so i am super duper excited i am going to be uploading some vlogmas um i'm not going to be doing it every single day but i am going to be uploading videos throughout december um just to experience my first vlogmas and yeah and give it a go i am super duper excited i hope you guys enjoy enjoy today's video if you guys would like some inspo or ideas of what to get the men in your life just keep on watching with the first one i explained with the women in your life in my her gift guide um for the first one which is the exact same as the men's and it will be for children as well um so i might as well get that one out of the way which is chocolate you can't go wrong with getting somebody chocolate for christmas i if you ask my niece at the moment christmas on Christmas Day, we are sitting down, opening toys and having a feast. And including that is chocolate. So getting someone chocolate on Christmas, especially men. My boyfriend absolutely loves chocolate. He has his favourites and I always get him chocolate on for Christmas and my dad. So yeah, it is such a cute gift. And also if you can't afford a lot, chocolate is just it's just a little bit of something just to show your appreciation and it sometimes a little goes a long way so having providing them with that chocolate it can just show their thought into it so yeah i think chocolate is such a good gift you can get chocolate gift sets now um hampers of chocolate so yeah there's different ideas that you can go with um other than just buying a chocolate bar or a celebrations or anything like that so there's different ways you can go around it um my second gift idea which will be a range of different things for this one so you can go around along the lines of boxes for men um just because they have the calvin klein brand and hugo boss which is quite a popular brand um i know with boxes so that's quite a popular brand you can get with boxes and underwear for men. Um, my boyfriend's not necessarily into um, designer boxes, but I know there is quite a lot of people out there that are into designer boxes. Um, they do like deals with Calvin Klein where you can get like three for two, three for 25, I think it is. Um, so yeah, it's quite a good deal. So you can get like boxes, which are um designer or you can just go to primark and get them some boxes i know my dad said that he would appreciate some new boxes this year so yeah some boxes um or even in boohoo they sell like i think it's meant to be like dupes of calvin klein's um in boohoo which is think, actually quite a good idea um so yeah they sell like packs of three even packs of five i think they sell in boohoo so yeah it's quite a good idea and also quite a um quite a good stocking filler uh, another one would be um which my boyfriend definitely needs but he's not getting um is some new clothes not off me anyway um i'm not gonna be telling you guys what i'm getting him because that boy if we watch it might spoil it but um he definitely needs some new clothes um some new gym clothes because he does like weightlifting and he splits them open all the time um so a good gift idea would be some like some new clothes some gym attire because in the new year majority of people are like new year new me go to the gym um so like some new gym clothes maybe some new joggers because i know my sister's boyfriend goes to the gym in joggers so like some gym joggers active leisure wear joggers um and also like or you can even get them like some nice clothes so not that gym wear is not nice clothes but like smart clothes like a nice smart shirt i did that for my boyfriend one year where i got him a nice smart shirt for us to go out for a meal 
um or some nice new trousers um or nice new shoes like smart proper shoes which loafers or anything like that that is really super nice or trainers you could get them some trainers i have i have had i have got my boyfriend over the years new trainers just because he goes through trainers like crazy like it's absolutely ridiculous so getting them some new like gym trainers is quite a good idea but also just like some everyday wear trainers or some smart trainers so yeah i feel like getting some clothes is quite like a basic present but also a quite a staple present um just because depending on the thought that's gone into it and the reasons why or you just looked at it and thought of them yeah i just feel like i you can't really go wrong with buying someone clothes um so yeah I think clothes is quite a nice idea to get somebody or shoes or a new coat which is quite a nice idea. Another idea on that region would be like some new pyjamas um, or a dressing gown like I said in my in the women's video you can get personalised dressing gowns now so that is quite a cute idea. I got my boyfriend a personalised dressing gown last year for Christmas which I basically wear all the time not him but it's getting somewhere out of it and it is such a cute dressing gown with his name on it and yeah i just feel like that's so cute and studio do such a good deal with personalized dressing gowns um they do like baby ones so you can get like your whole family um i did that for my friend last year um but yeah you can get baby ones for like six pound and then you can get the ch children ones for eight pound and then the women's ladies ones are 12 pound and then the adults men's are 14 pound so i just feel like for such a good family present or even just a men's present in that not necessarily just a men's present but i just feel like personalized dressing gowns are so thoughtful so cute and if you get the whole family it's just so thoughtful and cute so i absolutely love that um Another thing I would say would be if I'm going along the along the lines of personalised things, if I'm going to go in along that lines, um, I'd say like a personalised wallet is pretty cute. I know my friend got her boyfriend a personalised wallet with the, his initials on it, which is super duper cute. Um, you can get them a personalised phone case. You can also get personalised if you are wanting to spend a little bit more money. You can also get personalised AirPod cases. So when you buy AirPods, you can get the case that they come in personalised with their initials. I know my friend's boyfriend's got that. Anything personalised for me, I absolutely love. So just going that little extra mile, like one year. It might sound a little bit silly, but I got my boyfriend a personalised um dartboard with like my face in the middle because I thought we were going through lockdown and we were annoying each other and we were kept going into his like garage to play darts so I thought what a cute gift to get him like a personalised dartboard of my face so then if I'm annoying him he can go outside and you know what it's just in his bedroom and he finds it quite funny that I got him that and it's quite like a sometimes a silly gift but like I don't know it's just quite a funny gift so that is quite a funny gift to get someone like a personalised dartboard or you can get like at the moment you can get like personalised photographs which turn into like a cartoon I got my friend that for her baby shower but you could do it as for your boyfriend you could do it as like a photograph of you two or I've always got in picture frames or I've got a memory book with all our pictures on from like the year we got together he absolutely loved that like he ke he keeps that he absolutely loves that going on another route which I mentioned in the women's which is skincare and I know that my boyfriend this year has become more clued up on skincare um especially like because he likes to grow his beard so you could get him a beard and a brand new shaver um a razor kit you could get him the sell like sets of like beard oils and beard trimmers and beard face masks and yeah i quite like the look of that i know my mum gets my her stepdad every year like a skincare set from like boots because they do like three for two uh, or three for one whatever it is their deal they do like a quite a good deal so i'm almost my dad and her stepdad them um but yeah i just feel like that's quite a nice gift um also because you've put thought into it um or buying them a brand new skincare that you might know i remember in ellie darby's video what was it last year or the year before she explained that she got connor her fiance um some new skincare like elemis or yeah i just feel like it's so good um 
and um, quite a nice idea just because they probably didn't even think about that they needed it so another one to go along those lines is some new aftershave which i feel like is such a cute idea getting them like an aftershave that is like you feel like they will smell nice in i always love my boyfriend hugo boss he has so many different flavors now <laughs> flavors scents of hugo boss um i always just get in one of them i just feel like that is quite a nice smell but there is different um aftershaves that you can get which i just feel like if you've gone out of the way to pick someone a smell or a scent that you like them in i just feel like that is such a cute and thoughtful gift because you like them in that so yeah i absolutely love that idea going on to like the more expensive gifts i always find it so hard picking men's picking out the men in my life christmas presents i always do so like last year what did i get my boyfriend i got my boyfriend some new headphones um from boss so i got him some new boss headphones i got him a google hub like a google hub for his bedroom um i got him some gym equipment so gym accessories which is quite a good one if they're into the gym they do a strength i'll put a link down below to our website they are quite expensive they are an american brand but my boyfriend absolutely loves them i got him like a belt he always his mum got him a belt from there and then i got him like a um like a strap thing for his arm i think it was it was a strap for his arm or a strap for his leg i got him one of them and some pre-workout so i feel like overall that is quite a cute gift um for my dad last year i got him a dash cam which i feel like that is such a good gift i actually have asked my boyfriend and my mum for a dash cam this year just because i have just passed my driving test and i i don't know i just really wanted one i just feel like i feel a bit more safer on the road with one um and yeah my boyfriend has had one i got my dad one last year and yeah he absolutely loves it another one for um cars would be like you can get as like a stocking filler you can get a wheel cover um for their wheel i my friend has one but i feel like that's quite a cute gift for men you get them like a leather one color fluffy one yeah i just feel like sometimes in the summer it can go really hot so if you get them one fluffy one it might not as be as hot in the as in the summer so that's quite a nice idea or my boyfriend was gonna get my dad like a sticker for the back of his car called dad's taxi because my dad's always driving me and my sister's around so yeah that's quite a cute gift as well another cute gift i would say i i said in the other one like a coffee machine um i know my friend boyfriend just got a new coffee machine for his birthday so yeah i feel like if you're really into coffee and you don't have one i feel like a coffee machine is such a good idea i know that last year for christmas was it connor uh, ellie darby got her fiance connor a coffee machine so yeah it's quite a good idea and you can just like i've got a coffee machine for my 21st and i absolutely love it i generally it's my favorite thing in the world so yeah i appreciated that gift so so much another one would be like an xbox or a playstation um that is quite a cute gift the new xbox and playstations that came out last year so that's quite a good gift um a bit more of an expensive side i know the xbox are ranging between 400 to 200 pound and with the playstations i feel like they're very similar as well um another one would be in Primark and in Home Bargains, I know if they are into Xbox or specifically PlayStation or anything like that, in Primark or Home Bargains, they sell like, they sell like Xbox lights, like in the shape of an, like the shape of the logo of the Xbox and they sell like aftershave and like the space of like the shape of the xbox and playstation so i feel like that's quite a cute gift um you could also get them a gaming chair if they have like a gaming station i know my boyfriend just does it in his bed but some people have like a computer set up so you could get them like a brand new gaming chair you could also get the gaming chair personalized it's just the I just feel like with anything, you can just go the extra little bit of the mile. You could get them an Apple Watch. I got my boyfriend an Apple Watch for his birthday or AirPods. Like I said before, you can get the AirPod case personalised. Another one would be, I got my dad last year a football top for Blackpool. Um, just because he absolutely loves, he supports Blackpool. So I had a football top for Blackpool, but you can get them. I know my boyfriend gets his dad every year or for his birthday, like, collects rugby tops because they're like a rugby family they're all into rugby so you can get them like a rugby top or you could get them football or rugby tickets or cricket or whatever they're into that support you could get them into like tickets for them 
also you could get them concert tickets i got my boyfriend one year the chain smoker tickets for christmas um but yeah me and my boyfriend are not the best for crowds so that didn't go very well but um it was the thought that went into it so you could get them like a concert tickets or you could get them a holiday i just feel like with christmas there is limits if you want to go if you don't want to spend so much i feel like i feel like you don't have to spend so much on christmas i feel like sometimes it can get over the thought of buying presents takes over the thought of actually christmas christmas is about spending it with your families and sometimes presents can override that so i feel like some people do get carried away um but also sometimes it's nice to spoil each other it is nice to like appreciate if you've been through such a tough year it's nice to spoil one of it, one each other so like sometimes it can be too much but sometimes it's necessary if you've had such a bad year um, another one would be like a holiday you can book a night away for the two of you not necessarily abroad but like a cabin i got him two years ago a little a little two nights away in a yorkshire cabin with a hot tub and it was just so cute and yeah it was just so nice or you could you could book to go abroad. My boyfriend got me one year to go to Cyprus. So yeah, you could book to go abroad. Um, but yeah, I just feel like that's quite a nice idea. It's very thoughtful. Um, and sometimes, sometimes the thought into a present is more than the present, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, a night away, you could book, make an arrangement with his friends to go, depending on who it is, to, to arrange a day out, like paintballing, or you could go to like a cocktail making class or a baking class, just depending on what they're into. Um, you could buy them a new Xbox game. I just feel like with 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 presents, you could, there's so much you can get somebody. Um, and yeah, that is all my presents ideas for men. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. This is my first ever one, and I've enjoyed like sitting down making a list of what I feel like someone would like um i hope you guys have enjoyed today's video i hope you've enjoyed my suggestions and ideas sometimes for men especially i find it hard to get someone a gift so it's nice to have like a video to click on to see some ideas or suggestions um but yeah thank you so much for watching today's video my children's video for gift guide will be up out in the next couple of days i am super duper excited and yeah i hope you guys have a lovely rest of your week i hope you're all enjoying vlogmas december enjoying spending time with your family and friends um and yeah i hope you guys all have a lovely rest of your week speak to you guys soon bye